pays us a visit. He was a member of the uh, cast of SCTV, and his films include Inner Space and other films. His films include Inner Space. That's one of them, but there have been other films. <laughs> they just don't happen to be on these cards. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, please say hello to Martin Short. <laughs> Martin Short. Yes, sir. Other, other films. Inner Space. What, what are the ones you that I You couldn't remember any of the other films. I could. I and could. yet I can remember every one of your shows. <laughs> the David Letterman morning That's right. Uh, event. Over and out. What was That's it called? It. That was it. The morning event. Um, you, were, uh, you were in the original pilot for Charles in Charge, weren't you? Do we count that? <laughs> yeah, I was, I was in that. Yeah. Uh, and you were in the Mary Tyler Moore Hour. No, it was good. You did that whole dance thing. Shut up, Martin. And then, uh, <laughs> my first film was Three Amigos. That's right. There you go. There you go. You, uh, you look, uh, relaxed and, and, uh, like you're on summer vacation. And you even have a kind of a different, looks like maybe a vacation, sort of an experimental vacation haircut. <laughs> Something you're trying out. But just, we were trying it. Now, this is, I, I, I listened to a guy. I have this haircut because I listened to a guy who said to me, do you know what would be fun and totally different for you? <laughs> the kid from Deliverance look. <laughs> and it does have... It does have a... It, it has a little... Dun, 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 dun. It might not... Uh, the suit is new. I got this from the William Frawley estate. It's a whole new look. <laughs> Uh, now, th I'm guessing that the, the haircut had something to do with your last uh, film, Yeah, I just right? finished uh, a movie with uh, Nick Nolte. Mm -hmm. uh, it's, well, it has no title yet. Yeah. It's called the Nick Nolte Marty Short thing for mm -hmm. Christmas. <laughs> and, uh, uh, but it's, uh, and Nick was a great, Nick's a great guy. Mm -hmm. he, we, uh, we just finished it. Uh, he would do, he would do, uh, he had done this film with Captain Hepburn called The Ultimate Solution of Grace Quigley. So I would do Hepburn How long with him. In, I don't, don't have yeah. dates with me. My, I left no, my I'm list sorry. in the room. It just doesn't, didn't come to mind as being uh, a recent effort. No, I would say probably uh, mid-80s. Mid-80s, yeah. okay. Anyway, I would do a Hepburn with him. I would do, you know, I'd, I would say, you know, can we get this bloody scene finished so we can get the hell out of here? <laughs> and he'd say, oh, get off my back, you skinny old broad. <laughs> <laughs> He's great, though. He's Did it good. turn out all right, the film? Yeah, I think it's very good. Action-adventure kind of uh, buddy picture? It's a back, it's a buddy picture. Did you say buddy picture? I, did, I think yeah. I did say buddy picture. Well, it is a buddy picture, but it's so much more, Dave. It's so much more. <laughs> Let's put it this way. At no point in the film are Nick and I in a car driving where we look out the window and go, Ah! Oh! <laughs> Simultaneously. We don't do that. That alone. The writer that alone yeah. makes it a whole sure. new genre. <laughs> the, speaking of French, the director is French, you know? Uh, who, who is Francis the director? Francis Bebert, wonderful director. Mm -hmm. It was uh, interesting. The only thing you had to be careful of, you, could, you had to be careful when you did your Marie Chevalier put-downs. You couldn't just do them in... See, an interesting thing. <laughs> Morty said, why that joke? Uh -huh. But I said to Morty, let me relax here. He said, oh. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh, it's interesting because we have uh, uh, someone in our audience tonight from France. Well, that's why I that's did it. Because, cause it because you had just set fire to the air with your French stuff. <laughs> and I wanted to come out and top it. Yeah. So, reprising this against my better judgment, you had to be careful then to where and when you did your Maurice Chevalier put down. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. You couldn't just say, "Let's." Who wants to grab some frog after work? You couldn't uh, do that. Yeah. <laughs> you know, you had to say French food. Uh -huh, I you know, see. stuff like that. Okay. <laughs> now, then you you mentioned up north. Yeah. Yeah, I, I've been. Uh, I was up north. You're spending your summer up there now. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. yeah. I, I went. Now, what does that mean? Do you have a, a little retreat? It's a very secluded place. It's an island. There are a couple of cottages on it. What's the name of the island? What body of water is it in? Lake Muskoka. Muskoka. Is it, that's not one of the Great Lakes, is it? <laughs> <laughs> eh, can you take a Glendale? <laughs> no, it's not one of the Great Lakes. Where is Lake Muskoka? Lake Muskoka is, I don't, uh, it's, it's about 150 miles north of Toronto. Ah. ah. And uh, you'd go there... <laughs> You, you know, trappers applauding. 
<laughs> you go there. You go there to get away from things. Of course you, know? you do. You don't want. No. You don't want the phone ringing. Hello, buddy. Not now. You don't want that all day. No. Yeah. You want it. You the first week. You you you're, you're just kind of a little bit bored. You know. You're kind of. <laughs> oh, a boat. Mm -hmm. That's. A, then you, you kind you of. You and your wife and two two, two children. children yeah. Catherine and Oliver. Well, this sounds great. Oh, it's great. And then uh, also Eugene Levy and his wife Deborah and their children. Yeah. You shared it. Very funny man. Thank you. Oh, Eugene. Well, and, uh, and then around the second week, uh, you just really get into it and start eating, and, you know, your weight gain, and uh, then around the third week, uh, you're totally bored again. It's yeah. an up and down thing. Yeah, yeah. Well, I think, I think that's a good process. Yeah. We had a neighbor who would, uh, it was a dentist who would, you know, you would be right into the lake in the solitude, and he'd come knocking over, hello, how are you? And he'd, do you know what's amazing about Chaplin? And you're just going to sit there and suffer a migraine as you had to go into details of why comedy and... You know, what happened with Amigos, anyway? It should have been funny. Oh, no. Yeah. <laughs> Now, see, the, the, I like you. The, you the film was funny. I, I can remember going with a bunch of people from our office to see a, 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 some kind of a screening, and we laughed through the whole thing. Yeah, yeah. Well, I like. Were it. there those that thought it was not funny? There were. There some people had problems. <laughs> <laughs> I remember Leonard Malton saying parts of it I really liked, and other parts I didn't like at all. <laughs> <You know? laughs> uh, we have to do a commercial, and we'll be back here with Martin Short, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> is here and um, used to work as a not work but you started maybe you didn't even start but you at one point made your living as a singer that's wrong too no try again you at one point in no, show business true. sang yeah it's true I, I would there was a show in Canada in Toronto called everything goes and it was um, I was like a uh, a boy singer mm -hmm. I would come on do like you know a song from this Pippin a, a or television something. show or a... yeah it was hosted by Norm Crosby All right. Uh, which, uh, and it didn't, it was a 90 minute variety show every week. And I used to come on about once a week and sing. And uh, uh, this one night, Tony Bennett was on as well as I was. And I was very excited that Tony Bennett was right. going to be on, because, you know, an idol. How old were you at this time? Uh, 22, yeah. you know. But still, I, I spent a lot of life, you know, you were out protesting and the whole world's watching, the whole world's watching. <laughs> and I was in my attic going, Weather-wise, it's such a cuckoo day. I never, I never, I never jumped on to the bandwagon of protest that you sure, were. You were down that. here yeah. saying, yeah. just a rose, yeah. officer. But I was <laughs> listening. So anyway, what was I saying? I don't know. You oh, yeah. oh, yeah, so I saw so Tony Bennett. So Tony Bennett is the guest. Uh -huh. And uh, I see that he's a guest, and I'm very nervous, you know, and I think, oh, my God, Tony. Well, they said, don't worry. He's on the top of the show. You're at the end of the show. And I think, uh, okay, that's fine. So there's a snowstorm, and he gets in very late. So I'm in the green room, and Tony, they come rushing through with Tony, and, hey, I'm excited. And he starts singing, you know, forget your troubles. Come on, get happy, the Lord is... And they say, great, Tony, but let's, you know, wait till we get on stage. You know? and <laughs> he was excited, pumped, as you yeah. say. And so, yeah, uh, sure, yeah, and so, uh, anyway, he's, he's on stage and he's killing, he's in great voice, you know, when Joanna left me, and the audience is screaming, and during the number, they, they come in and say, you're on next. <laughs> and I say, you, 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 you can't follow a singer with a singer. Yeah. And they say, watch. <laughs> and they, they, they set up the chair, the stool, downstage, as Tony is just killing. I say, I love Chicago and he's just and uh, then he ends and they're ah, more, you know and he can't and he leaves and they cut over to Norm Crosby and says that's really great and now here's a kid who sings real good Marty Short <laughs> and it cuts to me and I'm sitting there just and I have a bad look you know uh -huh. it's long hair but with pants that don't work it's cut across between clam diggers and bell bottoms uh -huh. it doesn't know it's kind of flaring up here yeah. you know <laughs> And it's really a sad look and a belt, a belt that's way too big, you know. Uh, a Vivian Vance belt, almost. Uh, and a sweater that's funny. So I'm sitting there, I'm nervous, and, and, and the music starts. I'm singing You and I, the Stevie Wonder song. And I'm at my, I, I, I look at the guy and say, what a spot following Tony Bennett. And nothing reacted. <laughs> and it's just kind of, you know, the cricket. They didn't care. No, they didn't care. It wasn't their problem. No, so I start yeah. the song. Here we are, 
on earth together. <laughs> it's you and me. And already I'm wrong, because the song is you and I. So every lyric went from my head, yeah. and I started to make up lyrics, inadvertently impersonating Tony Bennett. <laughs> so I would go, here we are on earth together. It's you and me. Our love was made, it was made in heaven too. And then I just had to keep going higher, and now there was nothing. You and I, you and I, you and I. It was just a complete disaster. And then afterwards, I was just in the bathroom, kind of throwing cold water on my face, trying to recover. And uh, uh, Tony Bennett came in, and, uh, and I thought he was going to say something profound, but he just yeah. said, You froze good, kid. Well, good night. <laughs> It froze good, and, that, and then it was history. Yeah. Blew right out of there. Yeah. Um, what do you, anything to plug before we wrap this up? Well, first of all, I'm only here because of an extreme amount of love and then caring that I have for you oh, bless and you your up. show. Thank you very much. But I would like to plug something. Uh, <laughs> no, I, no, in September 10th, the, the Totally Mental Misadventures of Egg Grimley, Saturday morning, 11.30, NBC. Oh, great. Animated uh, half-hour show. Totally. It's the totally, the totally mental no, no, misadventures of Ed Grimley. Jonathan no. Winters, Catherine O'Hara, Joe Flaherty in live action. Oh, uh, Andrea is. Martin. So it's not just a cartoon. It also. is a cartoon, but except a cartoon. Joe, when Ed is a big fan of Count Floyd, and when he turns on the TV, you go into the TV and it's Joe Flaherty well, live sounds action. sounds like a good idea. Yeah, it actually is very funny. Yeah, it's good. Really good. Well, we'll be looking for that. And yeah. the other film is out uh, when? Christmas At time. At Christmas so time, yes. Good to see you. Good to see you, Have sir. a great summer. Thanks for being here. Martin Short, kids, and we'll be right back.